let's say water waves, any kind of waves, uh, then it's easy to understand. Because what's happening then, and this follows, physicists knew this back in the 1700s, right, is that you can consider each slit as, as a source of new waves. And the waves come out, and waves have the property that they can interfere with each other. So you can get the peak of one wave arriving at the screen from one slit, and a trough of a wave arriving at the screen from another slit, and if everything's lined up correctly, the peak and the trough cancel out and you get nothing. So you get this property where, where something from each slit, it's very easy to understand if it's a big extended wavy thing, lines up in such a way that it cancels out. And then it could line up in such a way that it reinforces and you get a big disturbance there. And then it cancels out again and then it reinforces again. So you can imagine this stripy pattern on the screen, that's what you get with waves. 